Thank God for that. I have no money to repay you, but I do have some information that might suit your skill set. Howdy viewers, Brad doing another Red Dead Redemption 2 video. What's interesting is how you can bump into some people and random encounters and you can make a decision as to whether or not you want to help them out. In this case, I decided to free a woman from imprisonment in a uh, stagecoach and we'll see how things play out here. Thank God for that. I have no money to repay you, but I do have some information that might suit your skill set. The Valentine Doctor is cozy with the O'Driscoll boys. I've seen them come in and out. Heard they use it as a place to count their money. Maybe you can show those bastards they don't own this land. Yeah? Thank you. Really. I'll, I'll be on my way. Sure, sure, but you got a high tail, trust me. Now, that's interesting. The Valentine Doctor is cozy with the O'Driscoll boys. And maybe you can use that information at some point. One of the things you need to do in Red Dead Redemption 2 is loot bodies. You can always find some interesting stuff. Now, one of the things I was trying to do is steal this stagecoach, or whatever you want to call it, uh, prison coach. And, well, it's not worth any money, but the horses are, and I didn't realize I could release the horses at some point and take them to a stable to sell them. But that is my mistake. And things, well, you learn as you play. I'm Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. If you like this video, hit the like button, you know, or hit the thumbs up button. Leave a comment. I like responding to comments, as long as they're nice. Otherwise, I delete them. If you like this type of video, well, hit the subscribe button and bell icon. And I post four videos a week, and you don't want to miss out. Thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and thanks for stopping by.